What's going on? In this video, we're going to be installing two smaller mods to the C8. Um, let me show you what they are real quick. First thing that we're going to be installing, well potentially, I don't know what order we'll do it, is this carbon flash um, license plate bracket. And the second thing we're going to be installing is, and I got both of these from Paragon Performance, is the Solar Performance electronic throttle controller. I have a throttle body from Solar Performance. I'm really curious how this changes the driving dynamics of the car. Um, people have said that it makes the car feel a lot more responsive, it feels quicker, which makes sense is what it's supposed to do. Um, I have seen a couple people saying that it helps the zero to 60 time. I doubt that makes no sense because it doesn't actually add power. It just improves the responsiveness of the throttle. Um, but I'm hoping it feels a little bit more fun to drive. I've been craving something a little bit more. It's like that endless cycle. So we'll see how this goes. I will see you guys outside. I'll kind of do a how-to. This probably isn't the video to look at for how to install this or this, but I will still kind of do it just to show you guys what we're doing. I'll see you out there. So first thing I'm gonna do is probably work on the throttle body um, or the throttle body controller because the car needs to be like off for a certain amount of time. So the idea that I had being so smart is I'm gonna basically turn on the car, do everything of like the starting steps that we need to do for the controller, leave it off for those 10 minutes. And while that's off for the 10 minutes, we'll put on the license plate bracket, which should be perfect. But let me show you guys what the bracket looks like now so we can get a little bit of a before and after. Okay, so that's what it looks like now. And it's basically just gonna fill up that. So this is what it looks like currently. Let's go check this, excuse the mess. We've got this. I'm gonna read the instructions for this real quick. Like I said, I'm gonna be installing that kind of at the same time. So we'll see how it goes. Let's, uh, I'm gonna check it out. Okay, so the first step is done. It basically is said to open the car. I put the top back because I thought it'd be a good idea. Open the door um, and the trunk and then, or frunk, and then wait 10 minutes because some stuff's happening with the computer. I need to let it fully turn off. So during that 10 minutes, we're gonna work on this real quick. All right, got a little bit of an update. So I've got the license plate area all prepped. That's good. I've got the double-sided tape applied to that. The car's been off now for more than 10 minutes. I'm being super safe. And I've got the pedal off and ready to go for the controller. So I'm gonna double check how to install this thing and I'm gonna get it done. All right, everything has been installed pretty much. Um, so we're gonna go out, give it a test drive, see exactly what it does. Installing the throttle controller was really, really easy. Um, and I'm really excited to see kind of what it drives like. So let's get into it. Okay, so I'm driving an OEM right now and it just feels exactly like normal. So. Nothing too crazy. I'm gonna get to the stoplight here and let's flip it over. I'm just gonna go straight into sport and see what happens. So stop right here. Okay, I'm gonna go, I'll go sport three. Okay, so we're in sport three. I'm just driving an OEM. Feels totally normal, totally stock right now when I just drove it. So uh, we're gonna see what happens here. Okay, yeah, I definitely noticed the difference. Yeah, like you barely, I'm in Sport 3 right now, I'm barely. Okay, yeah, it definitely feels a little bit more responsive, that's for sure. Okay, so that's cool. I'm gonna pull up the windows. Wow. I mean, that's a, even right there, just in Sport 3, like that's, a pretty big difference so that was sport three that was quite interesting let's go ahead and dial it up to sport six now the other modes you can see here oem comfort sport and you've got up to nine different sport levels i'm gonna do six like i said there's ludicrous <laughs> so that does uh drag race ai i'm not sure what that does valet weather and economy i don't like weather and economy it's just a lot it's a lot less um so we're we're gonna see sport six is the next one that i'll try out and then maybe i'll try like sport nine i don't know 
<laughs> it's freaking nerve wracking trying the other one. So we'll we'll start with that. I'll I'll get rolling again when we're there when we're going. I don't know if I made a video on this, but I did add more carbon down here, which is nice. So now the car is looking pretty carbon fibered out. We got carbon here on the speaker grills, carbon here, here, everywhere. Oh god, we're going. Okay. Whoa. I'm just like barely putting down the throttle. I wonder what full open is gonna be like. Well, I don't need to put it all the way down. Wow. Okay. That's pretty crazy. Wow. All right, so like I mentioned, we're in sports six right now. Um, quite a big difference to what it's normally like. I'm going to try sport nine. I don't know what the difference is between like Sport 9 and Ludacris. Like if, if it was, if Ludacris was on the sport scale, would it be 10? I'm actually gonna get to use Sport 9 and really like pedal to the metal here. Oh, someone cut in front of me. Boo. <laughs> this is awesome. Alright, we are stopped. Let me check out what this license plate cover looks like. But that is really, really cool. Such a small, very inexpensive mod. And I mean, I think it's more worth it if you get the actual like throttle, the physical throttle body in the car. But let's see what this looks like. That looks pretty cool. It's different. I think the fitment and everything looks nice. Feel like I don't know if I got carbon fiber up here everything else is carbon flash I love carbon fiber I love how it looks but I feel like it just would not tie together as well obviously the inside is all carbon fiber so I'm totally cool adding more stuff there but everything else being carbon flash okay so pretty cool stuff we are now going to try ludicrous mode I have no idea what this does I don't know if drag race is higher or ludicrous is higher but uh Oh no, there's a whole nother dial. <laughs> okay, um... Ludicrous 9. We're going straight from Sport 9 to Ludicrous 9. This Drag Race... Ah, so Drag Race is just one mode. Whereas Ludicrous and Sport have like a dial. So I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try Ludicrous 9. And I... Listen, I'm not expecting anything here, but I've, I've assuming... I don't know, there's a chance that the launch control is a little better. I highly doubt it. I'm gonna try it though, so we'll see. Here we go. Okay, so we just did a launch in Sport 2 and got a 3-1, like pretty easily. And usually, I don't know, I gotta warm it up a little bit or I'll get a little higher. That was pretty sick. And I bet you, in drag race, it'd probably do even better there. All right, so it was a day or two after that and everything worked out really well with the throttle body controller. I definitely recommend installing it. If you have a C8, or I'm sure it works the same in any other cars. So it worked really well. If you want me to do any other mods to this car that you recommend, or that you think would make sense for the current setup that I have, let me know. Like and subscribe if you want more content, and I'll see you in the next video.